I graduated from Poly in 2020. Um, right now, I'm a freshman at Georgetown University. And you studied student representation, right? Yeah, I looked at um, how the Long Beach Unified, uh, uh, the LBUSD uh, Board of Education could amend the student representation structures on the Board of Education. Yes, and you sent me your, your research. I and did. it's something that I've tucked away because we are spending a lot of energy this year thinking about how to uplift student voice and being a student board member is one of the ways that we're, we're really thinking a lot about how to enhance the current experience of student board members um, for the future. So I've, I've tucked away your research. Justin, tell us about yourself. Yes, of course. Uh, my name is Justin Lim. I am a senior at Long Beach Poly High School and I studied modern digital labor exploitation uh, through different lenses such as uh, well, my example was through uh, wiki websites such as that of Fandom Wikia. Excellent. I don't know a lot about that, but I'm going to ask you some questions <laughs> about that in a couple of minutes. And Aaron? Um, my name is Aaron Hoy. I also go to Poly. I'm 17, and I studied blue light therapy and the circadian rhythm. You all are so smart. Just the, the thought of your topics, the three of you, is just um, inspiring to know about what you studied, first of all. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be asking you some questions about your, what got you interested in the topics that you studied and just um, the impact of your research on yourself and others. Um, my topic was um, blue light therapy. So. How I got there was honestly not so easy. Um, when we were picking topics in AP research with my teacher, Ms. Lawrence, I definitely struggled to find a topic like ASAP. So it took a couple of like trial and error. Like I wanted to find something that had a gap in research that I could fill. So I looked into more scientific topics because I felt that was the easiest route for me. And I came across this article about um, blue light therapy and acne healing. So they use blue light therapy for like healing acne scars and whatnot. So that was kind of interesting. And then I just looked into blue light therapy and then I came across this, another article was that, that was about um, how blue light therapy is used for it's for this disorder called seasonal affective disorder. Mm -hmm. So when the seasons change, your mood changes, it comes to like more depressive factors. And so they use this blue light box, which I also used, but their main focus was to cure the depression of those patients. But I read that the side effects were that they gained better sleep, more attentiveness and work ethic. So I was thinking like, oh, that sounds like it could be useful for high school students because we're the ones deprived of sleep the most, honestly. Mm -hmm. So I, that's how I got to my topic and that was it. Hey, I love hearing that story. And it, it just shows that sometimes persisting and that you're not gonna always know right away exactly what you wanna study, but you, you persisted and led yourself into finding something that was, was interesting. Very good. How about you, Emily? My experience was a little different than Erin's. Um, my topic kind of came about a little more naturally. Um, I actually determined what I was going to be researching over summer. Um, I was talking with this person, they were telling me about their school, and they mentioned that um, they were the board member for their school district. And I was like, does that exist in LBUSD? I don't know. And then, so I started looking into that and so I actually started my research process um, before um, school even started. Um, so I, I found myself really interested in the topic and found it was something I, I thought um, might be beneficial to other students in LVOSD and I, I really saw the application of it. Um, so yeah, I just stuck with that. And since you're already in college, Emily, did that lead you in, did that relate to your major, what you studied? What is your college major? My major is international politics. Okay. Um, it's really big uh, within my school to do research your junior and senior year. Um, so it, it's good that I'm already familiar 
uh, with the research method, I, I think that'll be very helpful in the future. And to have a published research paper already in my resume uh, kind of helps me out um, for getting those more elusive research assistant spots in college. Um, but I, I found that the, the skills required for research do, um, do help with my papers now. Um, maybe more so my seminar class really gave me those skills. Um, just being able to research and write long papers um, and being able to find credible sources. Um, but I do anticipate my research class to be more, more helpful when I'm a, a junior and a senior. I'm going to ask you about some of the skills that you developed in a couple of minutes too. So hold on to that. Justin, how about your, your topic and getting into the, to deciding on a topic? Um, I'd say I, I did a project similar to this my freshman year, but I'd say the interest really started uh, around like the summer before my junior year, which I was taking, I went to Stanford summer session because uh, they offered like classes for high schoolers uh, for the summer term. And so I signed up for that. And one of my classes was actually a communications class. Uh, and we were just analyzing stuff like um, digital labor and whatnot. And I think that digital labor lecture in particular, like was what stuck out to me. So when we were writing about uh, our final paper, sort of what we could apply those concepts to, um, my mind ran immediately to Fan of Wikia because like it's a website I use a lot and it's pretty widely used. So being able to take such a familiar website and apply stuff from a communications uh, perspective uh, really drove me to those like nine, around nine months of research of like getting surveys conducted and sort of putting that down into analysis and whatnot. So uh, yeah, it's, I got really into it. So I'm really happy with the problem that came out.